It's a shade after nine and the market is hopping Saturday morning. I just got set up. And in that bag is something. I just dropped them off. He said, here, I'll pick these up later. Let's go see what's in here. If I can figure out how to get in there. It says Mercer on the outside. Mm. Mm. Mercer. Another Mercer. Another long serrated Mercer. I don't know how to sharpen that though. Mm. Okay, stand by. We got action. Bowser's out today. <laughs> the pizza man is back. Stand by. I can't tell if this damn thing is on or not. Oh yeah, I see it's on there. Was it something that somebody said? Mommy, you know we broke the rules. Was somebody up there? We got a new guy. Honey, you know I died for you. Ashes laughing. Right behind him, you'll be able to see the big fire truck pulling up. They bring the fire truck to this fair every once in a while so the kids can climb on it. Was it something that somebody said? Mommy, you know we broke the rules. Was somebody up there can say loud? Honey, you know I died for you. They got your number. Well, I got another bag of knives. You remember the fellow brought me the hunting knives? This is a fireman's knife on that fire truck that came over there a minute ago. I'm just sharpened it up for him. So. I forgot what kind it is. I'll have to give you a report on that later. This is one some that odd kind of knife. And I don't care what business. But anyway, in that bag right there, I'll show you in a minute what it is. Gory in there. You will run into people that you don't see eye to eye with. Oh no! There was something else I was going to tell you, but damn, I can't remember what it was either. Old timers got me this morning. Oh, okay. Okay. I'll Sometimes get it to you in a minute. Seafood guy. He got rolled in there this morning. Flower Child Bakery, the best of it, is doing pretty good too. Got a line at the pizza store. The vegetable places are booming. And I'm doing okay. It's a good Saturday morning. A little hot right here in this shade. Look at that sun right there. Whew. I need for it to get higher fast so I'll be under the shade. Stand by. 
Hi, truck must have got a call. The market is wide open. I don't think in two years I've seen as many people here as there are right now. Not at one given time. Some nice dogs here too. I got a nice little automatic here, Benchmade 9500. Just about finished with it now. I haven't done the serration part yet, but I've got the blade pretty much finished up. That's a baby one. I've never seen a small 9500 before, auto. But there's a lot of military around here. I guess that's where it came from. Push that button in and she's ready to go. Stand by. Ninety five hundred. Done. Fine little night. It's 1145 and we got a, a break in the action. Not that we've had much action today, but we've had a little. Most of our action is we'll be at home, I guess. This is the same guy that brought me all the big hunting knives last week. If you remember the, uh, what did he bring me? He brought me a bench maze combat knife. He bought me a cold steel knife and a knife made from Canada. Well, today he's got his favorite pocket knife, he said it's a Kershaw. Then he brought a bench made, a D2. I don't know what model it is, I'll have to wait till I get home, get my high test glasses on. It says bone collector on it. Got a skull on it, deer skull. This is a really old case. Case, double XO. She's in pretty good shape. She just needs a little polishing up here and there. He's got his knives in good shape. He's full of piss and vinegar, busting at the seams. So he licked his finger and checked the wind. It's gonna be do or die. His other knife is some kind of skinning knife. Stand by. Made by Outdoor Edge in Boulder, Colorado. Well, at least the case is. Call a game skinner. Outdoor Edge. He's still jumping off the garage. Dinky Japan. All these years, people said he said, man, I can grab hold of this thing. It's the best skinner I ever had. So I got. That's what I got for homework. Stand by.